heard ago that I like that seem to be popping up every once in a while. So if I fall off the stage, please. Where's the safest place to fall? Off? Yeah, I, I, I feel a little more comfortable right here. I mean, some of these people might eat me. And you said yes. That is dirty. Dirty. This is a family. This is a government building. Very professional, very classy, and I am burping through the song. So I apologize. I've got it. I'm looking at you. Do you see that? Give me those. Give them to me. Now, hold on. I don't want to fall over. I want these, right? Shut up. She's going to beat her up if I don't take her. I want those right there. You are on the second row. <laughs> you are close enough to smell the Altoids I ate earlier. <laughs> There's some... The violinist right there. Stand, I can see up your nose. And you're about three times as far away as she is to me. I don't know what you're looking at. But you need to keep it from here up, okay? You too. You're just not as well behaved this evening as I would have expected as a military man. See these people in uniform? They will cart you out of here now. You don't behave. Even though I'm all scandalous myself, putting my hand over people's mouth everywhere I go. They jumped out of their seat for that one. You don't like her that much, do you? Jesse is a big fan of Kelly Ripley. Oh my! They're feisty this evening. You're gonna get me in trouble. You're gonna get me in trouble. Did you just say no, no to me? Shame on me. The people who have never been before, take a look at who has their hands up. Take a look. Take a look. Really close at them. Look at their faces. Try to. Trying to memorize their faces. They may look just like you. They may live near you. They may teach your children. They may go to your church. They will corrupt you. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. They're they're dangerous. I'm not singing Dreidel tonight. Sorry. Um, I've noticed on the front row there are a number of people, and there's one gentleman. Just one gentleman who is holding his cell phone. Um, do you need to make the call? Why, what's the cell phone for? There's escape clause if someone... What is that? Go ahead and talk. It's okay. We will not tell anybody you're here. A friend of yours is on the phone listening and stealing the show. I understand. I've heard that a few times. I'm sorry? She bought a seat. She bought a seat? Yes. And where is she? She's back home. And... <laughs> and who's using her seat? You are? I am. My seat. <laughs> so she bought a seat. She couldn't come. She's sick or something? She's sick. So you came and sat in her seat and are holding the cell phone up so that she can hear the show. That's pretty impressive. That's quite nice of you. Is this uh, who? Who is she? A friend of my wife. A friend of your wife. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little less sweet now. A little more suspect. <laughs> we are on the military. Don't ask. Don't tell. We're not going to tell anybody that you are here. I promise. Did you get? What about you? What's your story? You drank her. 
Well, thank you very much. I'm feeling so good about myself today. <laughs> What about you? What about your story right here? Your anniversary present. Oh, well, thank you. Love is in the air. And your story? She's holding on tight to him. He might be trying to leave. What? Kicking and screaming. What? Okay, well, at least you admit. Oh, that woman in behind you just thumped him in the head. Do you even know you? You can't thump something. Cindy, what are you feeling now? Are you two? I, was like, I hope you're together because you're latched on pretty hard. Are you two together? You're married. Cindy just put her hand over your man's mouth. What are you going to do about that? Good Lord. What? You want a contest? It sure wasn't for being the quietest. I'll take that. Hold on. What was your contest for? Just to What'd you have to do? I just had to fill out an entry blank, but I did all the time. Woo! <laughs> 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 that was hard. <laughs> Put a lot of questions on it. Name, address. I just had to work hard on that. Uh, well, thanks for suffering through it for us. What, um, the, can you what? Can you see my socks? The next thing we'll be asking to see my underwear. The heck? That made this show easy. I ain't got to sing. Somebody back there knows it? Okay, hold on, hold on. What do you, you stand up for me? It's not in the book? <laughs> Say again, what's your name? Teresa. Teresa. Woo! Teresa, where are you from? From Scranton, Pennsylvania. Um, you have a, do you have a guess for it? Do you have a guess for Malincazio? <laughs> Do you think that bothers me? <laughs> Cazio means to play with only the mouthpiece of the horn. So, not just scream at anything. So, um, I don't know if you can hear the, um, the, the horn section back there. They're going to they're gonna give you uh, an example of Malincazio. Give it to them, guys. we made it up this evening. <laughs> because all of you have been cheating every night and bringing dictionaries. <laughs> Shame on you. I'll teach you. What? Oh, I knew it wasn't a word. I knew he made it up. I was just playing along. Whatever. Are you getting all this on video? Because you have had a, I know you're gonna have a cramp in your arm. You have not put that camera down yet. I mean, holding it up. Make sure that clap is steady. Yeah.